14 days of love, day 11. Finally decided on you. It's been another perfect day with ya. Wanna lay with ya. Spend the night with ya. It's been my life with ya. Alright. Alright, alright. Yeah. Okay, guys, so what we're gonna do today is just give our spill on how we feel about Valentine's Day. Do we celebrate it? Do we not? Do we actually do something on it? Do we buy a significant other a gift? We're just going to give a little two cents on how we feel about the day. So, without further ado, let's get this video started. Okay, so first of all, my kind of view on Valentine's Day is that it's, it's just a day. There is no, in my opinion, a reason why one day should reflect how you feel about your significant other. You should be celebrating your significant other really on the daily. Not necessarily saying that you should be getting them gifts every day or whatever, but you should be showing some form of affection. However you show love, you know, take the love language test, figure out what's your love language. Obviously mine is um, public, what is it, display of service? Mine, acts mine, of service. Mine is acts of service, so I'm constantly doing stuff for my significant other, but I also have to take into account how she receives love, which majority of the time is words of affirmation. So you should really be doing that on the daily. I mean, of course, you, if you want to, you can kick it up a notch on one day out of the year, or you know, take into account birthdays and Thanksgivings and Christmases and all that type of stuff. You can boost it up on certain days, like Valentine's Day, if you want to. But really, you should be celebrating that love each and every single day. But I don't think you should be necessarily breaking the bank, getting the hundred-dollar ginormous bear, <laughs> the the chop box of chocolates and flowers and stuff, just for one day out of the year, just because the world says so. <laughs> and for me, I say I don't really care for Valentine's Day. Like, I used to be the person where I look at other girls and be like, Oh, I want what she get. Ooh, I want that, I want that, I want that. Now, I don't really care for it. Like, me, I could just be around him and we could just be like this. And, and I'll enjoy my Valentine's Day. Like, me, I don't like flowers. So, she don't. Don't give me no flowers. Like, I mean, you can give me flowers, but I, he know I don't like flowers, so he ain't gonna give me flowers. Obviously. Chocolate, I could buy that by myself. Bruh. Oh, he could buy me too, but I still could buy that by myself. I'm just saying, like, Valentine's Day is just one day. Like, you don't really have to be splurging just because it's Valentine's Day. And you know where in the book say you have to get something from your significant other, or you have to give your significant other something on Valentine's Day. No, you don't. Bruh. You can do that all throughout the year, obviously. That's why you with that person. Y'all are supposed to be doing stuff every single day. Uh, you can tell them how you feel about each other every day. You can send them I love you every day. You can surprise them in any and any day. Not just Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is just another day. I look at it as February 14th. That's all it is for me. And so, honestly, like I said at the beginning, I can be like this. And I'm completely fine with that. Well, basically what we're kind of saying is that if you want to do something special on Valentine's Day, go right ahead. For us, it's just going to be probably just a uh, date night because, I mean, we we enjoy our dates and we just enjoy spending time together. I mean, I may throw in some chocolate. I may throw in her favorite chocolate um, that she doesn't eat all the time. She may throw in my favorite chocolate. She may just give me some light and small, but it's not going to be like a you know necessarily a room full of roses right. that costs hundreds of dollars on just one day just because everyone else is celebrating love so we don't feel obligated to boost, right. kick it up a notch right but if you want to do it that's fine on you hopefully you don't have a high maintenance woman who requires <laughs> you to do it um i lucked out and had one that was understanding <laughs> and enjoyed the little things that i did day after day so that's our share yep Okay guys, so that ends our video for day 11. We have a couple more days until the 14 days of love series ends. Oh my god! But... Y'all, this video has been hard to pull out each and every single day. It has, but we've been working hard to give you guys this content. Make sure you come back for day 12 tomorrow. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, like, comment, whatever your thoughts are on Valentine's Day. Share some Valentine's Day stories that you might have. Hopefully they are positive, you know, but maybe they're not. <laughs> anyway, make sure you follow us on Instagram. We'll put it down in the video below. But until next time, peace.